What's up, everybody? Hey, if you're not wearing your seatbelt, I am on my way to run a couple of errands on this, uh, I believe it's what, May 19th today? Monday? Monday evening. Gotta go ahead, pick up laundry at the laundromat. I gotta go to the Walmart supermarket and um, pick up some cat kitty litter. And uh, <coughs> come back, take a shower, and go to bed. I'm tired. Mondays are very hard for me because Sundays I work from uh, 3 to 11 at night. Then I go home. It takes me, by the time I get home, shower, and everything, it's about 12.30 at night just to wake up at 5 in the morning the next day and get ready to work again. And so it's a little bit hard. My Mondays are really rough. Tuesdays it gets a little better. Wednesday and Thursday is my usual days off. So anyway, so here I'm leaving my complex. I think I'm gonna go to Walmart first. Yeah. The sun is glaring here. Head into Walmart first. Because that's the furthest store I gotta go to. And then, maybe I'll buy myself a $5 scratch off a um, Escape to Margaritaville. And um, pick up the laundry. Then um, go home. Shower. And uh, call it a night until tomorrow morning. Alright, this is my neighborhood, by the way. So this road will take me right to Walmart. Folks, it is, I'm very exhausted. I'll tell you, Mondays are so rough. Literally rough. But I make the best of it. Go straight ahead, and it'll take me right to my destination, Wally World. I hope you're enjoying the uh, bonus game extravaganza videos. Thanks to him for uh, trying to pile up as many crossword games from now through June 23rd. And uh, somewhere around that time in June 23rd, I'm probably gonna do a mega marathon for that particular day, uh, the day of his passing. It's hard to lose a loved one. I understand that, but it's harder when you're so far away from your loved ones that you never got to say goodbye. Um, that three months earlier before his passing, I did go up to South Carolina. I saw him, and uh, I gave him, uh, drove him up to Asheville, North Carolina, and he just loved it over there. Loved Asheville. And uh, we saw the transsexual nun on the tricycle. Um, I don't know if Richard Kelly knows about Asheville um, and what, what I'm talking about, but it seems to be a uh, popular symbol there. The transsexual on the unicycle dressed in a nun, as a nun. So, And every store in, the, in that area have animals, cats, dogs. They worship their animals. So... It was fun. I showed him that. He loved it. And, um, you know, that May, March 31st, I have a picture with him. That was when I was leaving South Carolina, and I told him I'll see him sometime in the summer by his birthday. And, uh, of course, that never happened. He passed on June 23rd at 3.15 a.m. So, but I'm not moping around. I just get have a lot of memories that um, that comes up anyway I'm here at the soup not the super Walmart this is called the way Walmart neighborhood market we have two Walmarts next to another to each other one is a super Walmart which is always packed as other stuff and this one's just a supermarket 
So I am here and on my girlfriend's SUV and I will be right back.